it was pretty hard to miss the auction price of $170 million for this Andy Warhol Marilyn Monroe screen print. Now, while I may not be able to afford a $170 million price tag, I can easily reproduce this same screen printed image on a leather bag. And if you like watching these videos, be sure to like, share, and subscribe, and also leave a comment down below as to what you are currently working on. I picked up this leather tote locally for about 500 yen. That's the equivalent of about $4.80 US cents. And the first step is to remove the factory finish. And today I am using the Angelus Leather Prepare and Deglazer. Next up, I will mask off around the center pocket that I am painting. I need a base coat for the bright yellow and pink to show up on, so I am using flat white straight from the bottle. And once the first layer has dried completely, comes the second layer of flat white from Angelus Direct. This is my photocopy of the Andy Warhol reference piece I will be using today. And the chalk paper that you see here is a blue Sorol transfer paper and the Amazon affiliate link can be found down below in the description. Painting time and I'm starting off with pale blue. Followed by Hot Pink. As I kept my original photocopy taped on, I can now go in and transfer my finer details. This brush here is a Princeton Select size 18 short liner.
For the cheek area, I am dragging some of the black paint from around her neck and pushing it upwards. This is the best technique for a dirty screen printed feel. All of the blue chalk needs to be removed before I put on the finisher. I can use either a damp rag or a pencil eraser. A four coat and a clear satin finish is perfect to make sure all of the colors stay bright and vibrant. And this is the complete Andy Warhol Marilyn Monroe inspired leather tote. If you have any questions, you can reach out to me through my Instagram or my website. Both links are down below as are links to all the products I used in this video. Big thanks to Endless Drug for the paints and thanks guys for watching.